Our lead story, Wayne. Yes. <laughs> We're taking action for your health for the next five weeks. And this week, we've been looking at the potentially lethal lung cancer. In the past, the diagnosis has been grim for many patients. But now they're finding that better science is leading to better outcomes for their longevity. Good morning, Mr. Stack. How are you? John Stack was tipped off that something wasn't right when he started experiencing back pain. I thought it was just you know, back pain from, you know, from the where I threw it out because once you do it, you know, you get it again. But the problem turned out to be much worse than he expected. Basically, I ended up going to the emergency room and they diagnosed me with uh, lung cancer. It had spread to my spine is what it had done. Stack had personal reasons for not wanting to go with the traditional chemotherapy treatment. My ex-wife, she actually died of, um, of liver cancer. And I seen what she went through with chemo. I didn't want anything to do with it. So he became qualified for a therapy, a daily pill that he takes called Tarceva. Very targeted in this approach, not haphazard like traditional chemotherapy. Uh, really targeted for the, the cancer cells, leaving the good cells alone. Dr. Wade Weaver from Florida Cancer Specialists works with Stack on his treatment. He says using this treatment avoids some of the dreaded side effects associated with chemotherapy. Hair loss, uh, low blood counts, nausea, we really don't see those to any significant extent at all. Stack says he did experience rash with this therapy. But that eventually went away. It's like my body actually got used to the drug. Two years after his diagnosis, Stack is now considered to be in remission, a prognosis that may have been different without this medication. That I had probably less than two years to live. They're so new, and then because they're so effective, uh, patients are, are not just living longer, but doing so with a good quality of life. So right now, my body's trying to get back to where it was. You know, I'm back gaining weight. I'm back, you know, everything seems to be on the upswing. Stack advises others who may be in this same position to talk with their doctor about these new treatments. And if I would not declined regular chemo, I would not have had this option. So, you know, my recommendation is before you actually agree to some treatment, make sure you know there is no other options. That's good advice. Well, I've posted additional information on lung cancer and treatments on my Facebook page. Look for Linda Hurtado WFTS under pages and like the page.